Well, Hamburg head coach Martin Yoll admits it'll be difficult for them to get an away win, but he's confident they will protect their first leg lead. At home they're very strong, away from home maybe not that strong, and we took advantage of that. And now... Yeah, it's uh, probably a big task to, uh, to try to win here. That won't be easy, but uh, there's a goal difference, so if we score one or two goals, will we... Will be an unbelievable good thing for us. Can do nothing about it. It's not only about Mark Hughes because he's a terrific man, but it's about the German clubs as well, and uh, particularly my club. You know, it's a big club, and to talk about other clubs all the time, it's 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 a, a bit embarrassing. Boxing now, and Manny Pacquiao's trainer Freddie Roach has warned Ricky Hatton he'll be knocked out when he faces the world's best pound-for-pound -pound fighter next month. Pacquiao will be stepping up in the wait for the IBO light welterweight title fight at the MGM Grand on May the 2nd. It'll be the Filipino Southpaw's first fight since his eighth round defeat of Oscar De La Hoy last December. I'm really prepared for this fight because Ricky Hatton is an aggressive fighter and he's a strong fighter. And, you know, um, he's one of the best fighters in the world, so I have to train hard, you know, um, drag jug to the mountain. I don't think the fight's going to last too long because Hatton will start quickly and he'll force Manny to start quickly. Both guys like to fight, so it's going to be short and sweet. I believe myself that I, I'm, I'm, I, I'm gonna win. I can win this fight, and I just praying to the to God that uh, nobody got hurt on, on, on May second. I've been studying tapes of Ricky Hatton. Uh, his chin's up in the air. His defense is poor. Um, we will knock him out. Pacquiao against Hatton is live on Sky Box Office on Saturday, May the second. Call 08 442 410 treble eight for more information we'll be hearing from alan shearer gareth southgate uh, ricky spradget and phil brown today as they battle to avoid relegation from the premier league we've more on the road to rome could we be in for a repeat of last year's champions league final so alex ferguson will hope so after manchester united became the first english club to win in porto Theo Walcott will have other ideas, though, after he helped Arsenal beat Villarreal and set up an all-English tie. And Nick Doherty has made a good start at the China Open. We'll have action from the first round in Beijing next.